Ladies and gentlemen, action! Let's get starting tonight's school. I'm Brady Mon. I'm Patrick Magoo. And welcome to episode 14 of Bear Cave TV. Unfortunately, our last. But as they say, all good things must come to an end. But we're still going to give you a great episode here, so let's get on with it. Boys and girls tennis both won the doubles ECC title coming up on two weeks ago now, both versus Fitch. Uh, Angelina insert a clip here or a picture or whatever. No, I just meant like the whole thing. But I guess right here uh, on whether they won the state championship that they're playing today on the day of filming. So obviously we'll know by Monday when this goes out. That's right. But congrats to them and we wish you luck for today, which is really Thursday, but you're seeing this on Monday. Also, baseball won the Division Three regular season title. And softball won both the regular season title and the ECC tournament title as well. They are back-to-back -back champs in the ECC. Congrats to softball. Great job. Thank you. Girls Lacrosse won the ECC regular season title with an ending record of 15-1 and one and made it all the way to the ECC title. Um, Boys Lacrosse also won their regular season title with a record of 14-2 and two and went on to win the ECC championship versus East Lyme 13 with a final six. score of 13-6. Um, good luck to every team in states, which I guess is last week. So Angelina, update us with a picture here, here on if boys and girls across both won their games last week. Boys golf competed in the ECC championship. Uh, since we're filming this on the day of, we don't know if they won or not. So if they did, Angelina, insert it here. And if they didn't, then just play a nice little song. Copyright free, of course. Good luck. Even though we make no money. Happy Pride Month. To everybody a part of the LGBTQIA plus community. Um, we're here to support you. Um, and we love you guys. So use the AFA Instagram right there. Nice Instagram. Beautiful. This week's quote from Mr. Mr. Marone. Champions aren't made in the gym. Champions are made from something they have deep inside them. A desire, a dream, a vision. That is, once again, from Mr. Marone, our athletic director, and also Muhammad Ali. I wonder if you put them in a ring, who would win? If we're talking about it right now, I'd hope Mr. Marone could win, but if we're talking about it in Ali's prime, I still give it to Marone. I've seen how fast them feet can move. <laughs> and last but not least, our final goodbyes. Patrick? It has been an amazing year. It's been fun. It's been real. It's been real fun. You know, guys, Bear Cave took a big leap this year. 788 followers. Started a show. Patrick and I started announcing some games, you could say. <laughs> um, and we know the show was a little inconsistent, but you can most likely blame me. And then when you're not blaming me, you're blaming Pat. Um, thank you to Angelina, thank you to Shia, thank you to Claire, thank you Mr. Rocha for allowing us to use the studio. Um, yeah, it's been a great, great series and we'll see if Pat can carry on the leg. Leave in the comments <laughs> who you want to be Brady's replacement. <laughs> Top comment we're bringing on next year. That's not necessarily That's true. Not next week. Not but, next week. huh? We're done. This is the last one. For the so year. next year. Oh, you said next week. For the last time, I'm Brady Mullen. I'm Patrick McGoo. Thank you all for tuning in. We hope we provided a great episode for you guys today. And go Bears. Go Bears. That makes me sad. That makes me sad.